Today's story is Inside My Heart and In My Head Feelings by Libby Walden, illustrated by Richard Jones. Inside my heart and in my head, all kinds of feelings dwell. As they spark and bounce around, I fall under their spell. Sometimes I want to cry and stomp and really cause a scene. And other times I laugh and smile. What do these feelings mean? Looking from the outside, I may seem the same as you. But deep beneath the surface, feelings bubble, stir, and brew. Brave. Facing all your fears head on, you scale the mountain top and ignore the voice of panic that tries to make you stop. The journey might be hard and the path may not be straight, but if you're bold and carry on, the view below looks great. Sad. With a crash, the river breaks, bursting through its banks. It happens without warning. No sorry, please, or thanks. It covers every inch of land until there is no more. Just a sea of salty tears with no sign of the shore. Angry. Deep beneath the surface lies a fire pit in the ground where blazing magma spits and bubbles swirling all around. The pressure keeps on mounting and your world begins to shake when a sudden loud eruption forms a scorching lava lake. Happy. Dancing to the rhythm of a noisy steel drum band at a party where the sun streams down and warms the soft white sand. There's cheerful laughter in the air, the ocean's cool and fine. The colors of the island glow in the hot sun shine. Jealous. When someone else has what you want, an emerald mist rolls in. It churns and froths and eats you up from somewhere deep within. Your vision blurs. Your mind is fixed on things you do not own. And as green steam begins to rise, you give an envious moan. Alone. Floating through the light blue sky in a single bubble, as though you've done the whole world wrong and now you're in deep trouble. Through the clouds you slowly soar as no one looks or listens. Far away from all the world in a ball that floats and glistens. Embarrassed. Your face feels like it's burning and the spotlight's shining bright. The world is staring at you in this pure and blinding light. The air is still and silent as your heart beats like a drum. You wish that you could disappear, but all you feel is numb. Excited. Standing by the bonfire on a crystal clear cool night, waiting for the fireworks to sparkle and delight. The bright and dazzling colors fizzle, glow, and pop against the darkness of the sky. The explosions are non stop. Afraid. Sprinting in between the trees and not sure of your way. You're being chased by something loud that just won't go away. Though you keep on running, 
it follows close behind. With snapping twigs, it feels so close. Or is it in your mind? Calm. Your little boat floats gently on an ocean smooth and blue. Softly rocking back and forth, you gaze upon the view. The seabirds serenade you as they slowly pass you by. And with the lapping of the waves, you give a peaceful sigh. Everyone is different and their feelings aren't the same. And what you feel is who you are. It's something you must claim. Try to walk in someone's shoes to see how they might feel. For though you cannot see them, feelings are still strong and real. Thanks for watching Storytime with Miss Rose. If you liked the video, make sure to subscribe and click the notification bell for more videos. If you enjoyed the book, there's a link to purchase in the description below. Thank you.